Premier Legault, um, during the spring, you were looking at the numbers, the data for long-term care facilities uh, for seniors with the outbreaks. Now, it's the schools. Uh, there is a case of uh, three students that tested positive in the townships in Saint-Sébastien, and there are three classes that now they are in quarantine. Uh, how are you sure you have the right approach regarding all the yeah. stress we see, and how would you change your strategy? But first, we decided to reopen the uh, bars, the restaurants. We agreed that uh, for uh, shows, they will be will allow 250 people. So these were the last decision we made. All right. Uh, of course, the priority is to keep schools open. I think that the decision that was made to have a bubble in each classroom was the right one, because we knew that there would be some cases in different schools. And now, when we see that, we only close the classroom, not all the school. So it's helping. So far, it's under control. It's about uh, the uh, numbers that were expected in the different schools. But we have to be careful. We have to be careful. In total, 180 cases, it's an increase compared to the beginning of August. Uh, and uh, it's almost a double. Of course, we're far from the 800, 900,000 cases a day that we had last spring, but it's an increase. So the, the trend is not good. So that's why last Monday I said, and I told everybody, I understand that you're tired to wear the mask, but we'll have to wear it uh, since still for many months. And just one clarification before my second question about the data that you will make public with the, the cases in schools, how this can make a difference for people? But it's a question of uh, informing the population. I think that uh, we have the data. Uh, we have to verify the data, making sure that the numbers given by the uh, service centers are in agreement with public health, that they, they all agree uh, about those figures. And uh, to inform the population, it's important. 